Last time on Sin City Blitz, you had El Nacho Cheese versus Solberg in a match that was, well, look, as you can see, Solberg actually took care of El Nacho Cheese pretty fast and Solberg was the victor. Next, you had lightweight champion Phoenix versus Strife in a lightweight title match. The match went back and forth, each wrestler getting their licks in, their blows in, and fighting the hell out of each other, but in the end, Phoenix got himself disqualified to retain the title. The next match was a six-man match, which had a lot of wrestlers, but ended up having Purple Pirate defeat Gravedigger and be the last one standing in that particular match. And then there was the American title match, Hillbilly Deluxe defending his title against De La Cola and Jesse O'Doul, but De La Cola seemed this night would be his night to be the American champion. And so it was. And next, All-American Skull faced Sidney Perello and Jack of All Trades in a triple threat match that went down to the wire. All these wrestlers putting their bodies, their hearts, their minds, and their souls on the line. And an incredible display of wrestling. And then, as you can see through all this, Sidney Perello was the victor. And then you have Sun Lee, who was in a one-on-two match versus Team Doritas. And it actually was pretty one-sided. Uh, suddenly did get a few licks and blows in. But Team Doritas, in the end, came out on top and are your victors then. Then the last match was a title match. Sin City Wrestling title. Cool Ranch versus the defending champion, Weed. Initially, Cool Ranch got a few moves in, but Weed actually took control of the match. And defended the title and got rid of Cool Ranch from that discussion.